think I've been giving a little too much attention to just the girls, so I'm giving some love to the boys. Yes, Mr. Orange. He's so sweet. This is Buck. Is this Buck? You're Buck, right? Yes. Oh my God, so cuddly. Although they are all super cuddly usually after they eat, so I think his belly's just full and he's very happy. Okay, let's do the advent calendar. Okay, so today we're gonna do two of the advent calendars. I'm not gonna lie, I already started recording when I was ripping it open. Or I actually wasn't recording, but I started it. Behind number three is a giant cookie today. <gasps> This is making my mouth water, like literally the frosting. I want to eat this. You're lucky. I'm going to give this one to Montana. Monty, sit. Oh, good girl. For the princess. Delicious. And now we're going to do number four, which seems to be smaller. Sorry, Moon. Oh, it's another macaron. Macaroni and cheese. These are seriously so stinking cute. Again, I'm gonna link this down below in case you guys want it, but the dogs love these. Moon sit. Gentle, gentle macaroon. There you go. All right, Mr. Micah, the time has come. I'm about to go meet your new owners who are gonna take you, so. This is a very sad farewell because this is like the kitten I got to bond with most out of all of them because he was the only one left. And I had to, you know, make sure he wasn't lonely the past week or so that he's been by himself. And the fact that him and Sakura are now like best friends is so crazy. So that's good to know for the future that it just takes like a week or so for cats to get along. Oh, it hurts. It hurts, but it's for the best for him, so. She said, bye. Get out. You can leave now. We're no longer friends. Sakura, do you want to go in there? No, you don't. All right, so he's off to his new family. Sweet guy. Oh, my gosh. So you guys have a couple cats already, right? Yeah, oh, thank God. two boys. Yeah, he's, like, <laughs> he loves to be around my cat, so... He's gonna keep them occupied for oh, sure. Yes. I'm so happy. <laughs> Yay. Thank you. Of course, thank you guys. <laughs> okay, we're in here. Daniel's got a literal. <laughs> she just bit it. No, don't do that. Look at all these little peppers. We just changed out the area and gave them all fresh collars. Who do you have? Aspen. She's oh, so sweet. she's loud though. So That's okay. My and so is Huckle. Huckleberry tits. Over there. Oh, I have some babies on me now. Hi. What I love about Purple is she literally just lets you hold her like a baby. Oh, big yawns. Oh my god. It's the pooping hour. We oh need to get out of here. We gotta get out. Monty needs to come in here. Get and me oh, out. Don't step in it. Monty. Monty, get in here. Monty. Monty. Good job. Get in there. Go. They are. Oh, this is their last. Their last, last supper. Day, yeah. Okay, the time has come for milk duds. Milking, milking to commence. You can milk anything with nipples, Joey. Oh, really? You can milk me. <laughs> the fraudulent milk. No, Monty, fraudulent milk. Milk. Is milk. Well, her titties were overdone last night. Yeah. And they were all tumbled up from the blow up. So we, Joey bathed her breasts. I did. I put Neosporin, Neosporin on them. Neosporin, and we put we did a bag bomb the other day, and they look so much better. Oh, they literally healed overnight. You're faking it. <laughs> oh. Uh, and she she slept with you last night. Yeah. She slept. She with you did. She slept last and night. And soon you get to come home with me and no. be here again. No, you stay. So yes, she's officially weaning today. The puppies are now gonna have the fake milk, which has all the nutrients and stuff. We're gonna do that for a day and then we're gonna switch them to kibble soon. So I have a new um, tray system. process, a new system. I did a, a lot of research online. And what did we do before? We just kind of let them shit whenever inside. Yeah, you tried litter box training them. It did not work, well, so. Well, because they're too young and I still think that would work, but this seems a little more cleanly because they poop, essentially you take a tray 
and then in the tray you have a pad, and then over the pad you have this a grate, grate. like this. What? Oh yeah, and they take a dump over. Basically, they poop through this into a pad with a tray, and then you can take the pad out instead of having to, you know, have them walk all over it. So hopefully that's coming in the mail today and we don't have to worry too much about the poop because once you stop weaning the dog off the mom- It's shit spill. Well, that's when she's like, that's not mine. Yeah, she's like, that's deep and dark and mysterious and it stinks. <laughs> I will not be eating that, yeah. so. <laughs> I'm um... not eating that shit, but I'll eat the other shit. <laughs> and the this. So let's see how they react to the puppy food. Daniel doesn't believe me that we're gonna have to blend this. Watch, watch it not mix up properly. Babe, what do you think came before blenders? Whisks. Whisk. Oh, the powdered milk is not gonna blend properly even though it's as fine as sand. <laughs> okay, well I've had formula in the past that does not look like that. I have it. Chunky. They have it, you're lying. Funky. It's because you were probably using a spoon to mix it. A fork. A fork. <laughs> Hi, puppers. Are you guys ready to taste something so yummy? Good morning. They're hungries. Oh my, don't say that. They're they hungry. <laughs> They're literally gonna walk all over this. So. All right, let me get in there. Let me get into the ring. This is part of the process. Oh, oh. oh no. Stay out. Get into it. Turn around. Oh. oh my god. Milk. Hey! <laughs> milk prints. Look at the little milky paw prints. Oh, that's cute. Oh my god. <laughs> Get out! <laughs> Yaro! Ravenous. She's like, ooh. Wait, they're spooked. Delectable. This is divine. I don't have to rip my mother's titties open for this. Confused. Oh my god, what? <laughs> he peed in the litter box? He peed in the litter box. <gasps> and now they're gonna smell it and they're gonna be like, this is where we go. <gasps> what? <laughs> Look at there's a line forming. There's a line for the restroom ladies. <laughs> <laughs> oh, go ahead. Too. I can see the tail coming out. No. Old yeller. Alright, we need to put them all in the box now to sniff. Sniff it. Oh, maybe go, go in there. Come on, girl. Go piddles. Oh. oh. <laughs> She's like, I'm just a little twig. Somebody peed there. I don't like that. Who was it? Which Raise one? your hand. I'm not asking you, beast. Okay, I just did a fresh blend. I added puppy food into the mix because the milk was just not enough. Like they're they're still so hungry. So I did a mix of puppy kibble blended with the formula and a lot of water. So this should fill their bellies up and they'll stop crying. But yeah, the poops are gonna start and it's gonna be messy. Oh my goodness. Also, the groomer is here to wash the dog. So Moon and Wolf are being washed right now and then Monty will go. And that's perfect for Monty, perfect timing because she no longer has to lay in the poopy area with them because she's weaning them off. So the only time they'll really interact is when I bring them outside, which hopefully will be very soon. Okay, Wolfie's back from his bath. He looks extra <laughs> chunky because literally he's so fluffed out, but he has this cute little necklace that they gave him. Yeah, Monty just went into and I asked if she could get bows. Oh, Wolfie, you look, you have just winter weight. It's just a winter weight you have on. You're extra fluffy, but you smell so good and you look so handsome. Oh, look at her pretty bows. Oh, she has to go, oh my God, her boobs are huge. Look at these pretty bows. She's a very pretty girl. She's ready for Christmas. She has her Christmas bows in. Oh my God, these are so big. They're also healing now, so they look pretty rough, but they looked much worse before. Um, they did a um, 
cleansed when she got groomed too on them, so. They're all taken care of. Oh my gosh, you guys, her boobs are completely filled to the brim with milk. They're just waiting. I know, but you can't give them anymore. They're weaned. She's like, but they, I need, I need someone to milk these, please. They hurt. Oh my God, it's happening. Good girl. That is Yaro, everybody who's pooping in the litter box. I put poop in here because they pooped in their crate area. She's the first one to actually poop in it. Natural. Oh, that isn't Yaro, that's orange. Oh, good job, Buck. Yes, Buck with the big butt. I was excited that it was a girl, but it was just Buck. Okay, so this works. This is just temporary till the other thing comes in. They're also so messy from eating food for the first time. So a lot of this is just their food on the ground and on their faces, but there's definitely some poop in here. So I need to change out their area and make this just poop smell and everything else smell clean. Oh, she's the loud girl. She's like, I want my mother's milk. I want it now. But this is just the reality of puppies, guys. It gets messy very quickly after. Oh, she pooped. Are you pooping right now? Oh, you're pooping. Oh, the boys in the litter box.